welcome back to my channel. If you hear any little noise, um, just know it's my daughter. She's playing around. But anyways, let's go ahead and get to what we're going to be doing in this video today. So I'm going to be doing kind of a little first impressions and tutorial Valentine's Day look with the new Anastasia Beverly Hills and Omri Z palette they just came out with. Isn't it gorgeous? It's like all pink. This is so her. If you don't know who she is, she's just a badass um, makeup person, influencer, beauty influencer on Instagram. And I think she has a YouTube video, a YouTube account now. So she does those two, but she's just awesome. And her fashion is just amazing. Her whole IG Instagram content and like pictures she does is amazing. And like the planning she does into it is just crazy. So yeah, we're going to be doing a little tutorial on this. I'll let you know how I like it at the end of it, but um, before we get into that, um, if you're not if you're not subscribed to my channel already, please hit the subscribe button down below. I do YouTube, I do vlogs, I do beauty videos, and I do fashion like style videos. So make sure to subscribe. That way you see all my new videos that will come, and hit the notification bell so you are notified every time that I come out with a video because YouTube is a little weird like that. So you don't want to miss out on any videos that I come out with. And if you like these videos and you want to see more of them, please give it a thumbs up. That's it. So we're going to go ahead and jump into the video. All right. So I zoomed y'all in a little bit that way you can um, see the process a little better just because we are only doing an eye makeup look today. Obviously I'll finish off with like my blush and my lipstick later, but we're going to do a little tutorial, Valentine's Day tutorial using the Omrizi Anastasia Beverly Hills palette they just came out with so we're gonna go ahead and open it up just so you can see this isn't really a like view i'm not gonna go into it too much but i'm just gonna show you what the palette looks like and we'll see what i create today i think i'm gonna go for like a purpley vibe today so yeah but here is the palette it's absolutely gorgeous honestly i love all of these shimmers i know they have like a few different formulas going on here like the mattes they have some shimmers and i think they have pressed glitter if I'm wrong, I'll put it somewhere right here, but I think it's pressed glitter. I can't remember which two are um, the pressed glitters, but yeah. She swatched them and they're absolutely beautiful. I will not be swatching them. Um, if you wanna see swatches of it and all that kind of stuff, then you can go ahead and head over to her Instagram. And I'm sure she has a YouTube video up as well. So maybe I'll just link them for you down below if you wanna see those. But this is just gonna be a little tutorial and my like first impressions on it, so. Yeah, I think for our first shade, I think we're gonna go in with OG. It's this color right here. It's kind of like a tan color. It looks a little bit more neutralish than um, like warm, but it looks like a nice color. So, also for um, when I bought this, I bought the little mirror because I really wanted it. Um, I thought it was gonna be a lot bigger than this. I'm not mad at it, but I did think it was gonna be a little bit bigger. Now let's go ahead and jump in. We're going to be using OG. I'm taking a Morphe M518 blending brush, taking that with OG. And we're going to go ahead and pop that right into the crease. This will be our transition shade. Like I said, I think I'm going to go with like a purple look today. So we'll see how this goes. This is very pigmented right off the bat, which usually Anastasia's eyeshadows, I always have felt like they are very pigmented. It's really nice. It's just kind of like gliding on. It's a really pretty color as well. All right, so now I'm going to be taking this one right here, which is Shemsa. I think that's how she pronounced it. It's the name of her mother. So this purple shade right here. And I'm taking that on a Morphe M506 brush. It's just like a little pointed blending brush. I'm applying it right into the like eye socket and I'm just kind of using circular motions and windshield wiper motion. And then we're just going to blend it out a little bit. We don't want no harsh lines here. And now we're going to go ahead and go into this shade right here, Yugo. Um, it kind of looks like a dark plummy brownie color. So we're going to go ahead and pop that in too. And for this, I'm using a Morphe G18 brush. And we're going to put this right into 
the outer third corner. And then blend it out. All right, so we're gonna add a little shimmer to this. So we're gonna take this shade right here. It's kind of like a purpley shade. It's called Cupcake. And we're gonna pop this right on the lid. I think it's gonna look really, really pretty with this. And I'm taking this on a MAC 242. I don't know, I'm pretty sure that's what this is. It's like rubbed off so I can't really see, but this is like one of the OG brushes that you should have in your kit. Woo, you see that? That is some pigment right there. That is beautiful, I love that. All right, so I'm just gonna take the shade, the brush that we use to apply Yugo, and I'm gonna kind of blend out the edges so it's all kind of seamless right here and you don't see a line between the shimmer and the rest. That cupcake color though, bomb. Usually all of their shimmers are really nice and really pigmented, but this is just amazing. I love this color. All right, and now we're gonna be taking this shade right here. It's just a black shade. It's called BK for Brooklyn. Taking that on a Morphe Y21 flat shader brush. We're gonna kind of create like a eyeshadow wing liner. Now that is a pigmented black. And now I'm just taking the little M506 brush that we used earlier and I'm just going to kind of like go over the winged part of this to kind of give it more of a blended effect over here. I don't want the winged liner, like eyeshadow line to be too like perfect. I kind of want it to like fade a little bit into the rest. All right, now I'm gonna be taking this shade right here. I don't know if you can really see it, but it's like an iridescent pink purple. It's got so many different like reflex to it, but it's called Barb for Barbie. And I'm gonna be placing that right on the inner corner and my highlight or my brow bone to highlight. I'm using an E19 brush. Just popping it right on the inner corner. Boom. All right, now taking the same Morphe M506 and we're taking Shemsa. And we're gonna go ahead and place that right on the lower lash line. We're going for a smoked out effect here, people. And now we're gonna just pop on BK, aka Brooklyn, right up against the waterline. Connecting it with the top eyeliner, shadow, whatever you wanna call it. Boom. And then I'm just blending it out. So I'm gonna put on some mascara, finish my lips and my blush, and I'll be right back with a finished look. Here is the finished look. All right guys, so that is it. This is a look um, zoomed out so you can see. I really love this look. I love how it turned out. I love how sultry sexy and dramatic it is because i don't do this all the time so it's nice to glam up every once in a while especially when it's like valentine's day why not so yeah everything i've used on my face today like the makeup products will be linked down below i know i didn't show all of that and i started with like pretty much full face of makeup but it was centered around the omri z palette so yeah i just wanted to show a tutorial on that but 
it'll all be linked down below for you anyways and all my social handles all of that my website will be linked down below as well and if you're interested in like these necklaces that I'm wearing and like my jewelry that I wear. I just did a blog post as well on these, like what I'm wearing lately. Um, so I'll link that down below too. So yeah, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Give this video a big thumbs up if you do like these videos and you wanna see more makeup videos. And I will see you in my next video.